Hello, hello, checking in with the first uh, about 10, 15% of Future Home of uh, the Living God by uh, Louise Erdrich, uh, a 2017 novel uh, that is looking like it's going to start out with a horrible pandemic is kind of just cresting as Cedar Song, song Maker uh, reunites with her uh, birth mother, uh, uh, an Ojibwe woman whose actual name is Mary Potts, whose family owns kind of a pumpin' gas station kind of uh, gas station thing. Um, it's it's funny because I've heard all the stuff of like, oh, it's harrowing and stuff like that, but it's starting out pretty damn funny. Like starting off with Cedar being kind of really disappointed that her uh, native new native family isn't romantic isn't like you know uh the great tragic stories and, and 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 you know names and that they don't have like all have native superpowers it's just like you know she's kind of pissed about that her her um her adoptive parents being buddhists who she's rebelled against by by becoming a, a catholic and and it's like oh and they are actually catholics too and uh, there's certain things that you kind of go like, I think this is going to be, this is, seems to be satiric, S starting off with that um, Mary Potts, her, her mother, almost senior Potts, because there's actually another Mary, uh, grandmother, Virginia Mary, uh, Mer Mary Virginia um, Potts, who's uh, the, the senior, who is easily like over 100 years old, um, but the almost senior uh, takes her to a, tri a, a tribal council where she makes a presentation for um, putting up some kind of um, memorial for the appearance of a saint um, in, in their thing. Uh, and one of the things that the saint is a saint of is a patron saint of uh, people who get made f fun of for being too biased, <laughs> which made me laugh. Um, and there's just a lot of just kind of, yeah, undercutting and various things. Um, and Cedar believes that the father, she's pregnant. That's one of the things that's propelled her because she wants to find out, A, you know, who is my father? Why did you, why did you give me up for adoption? And, um, and uh, do you have any genetic, is there any genetic issues I should know about in the family? She's, she's super white presenting. She's obviously been raised by white family and is culturally very, very uh, white. And it's like, you know, um, and it's, she believes that she was impregnated by a, um, an angel. That is her story at the moment and she's sticking to it. So this, uh, the future home of a living God, I guess, is somewhat of a literal thing. And yes, all around them, there seems to have been some, um, some, some kind of virus, some, so, something like that, that they maybe came out of the permafrost, something like that. This is obviously, I guess, this is, yeah, the yes, guess. This is pre, pre the pandemic uh, that this, this story was published. And so it was probably even written even earlier, like 2016. You know, plenty of other hints that, you know, this could be one way we go and uh, one way we're, <laughs> we're going right now. Um, but yeah, it's got a lot of humor in it. Um, there is a young Mary, a little Mary, who is a uh, dresses as a Lolita goth who has um, kind of a seventh level level of hell bedroom, which is encrusted in layers and layers of clothes and and maybe use condoms and dead bugs and broken glass over clothes uh, that she is getting to know who who. Um, immediately pushes all her buttons it's like you're pregnant you're a whore and this is like you know little kid but um yeah so uh definitely going from louise, louise erdrich's other books this is a very different tone and it very much is uh satire so um i'm enjoying i was uh, you know i was worried you know, if I didn't know better, if I hadn't, uh, I didn't really know too much about it other than, oh, here's a Lu Louise Erdrich book that was free from the library on audiobook read by the author. Um, I, if I'd looked into it, I would probably gone, oh, 
it's a literary person doing a dystopian dystopian um, novel of you know post pre post apocalypse it's like oh how is this going to go how serious is, is this going to be but so far um so good i i'm hoping things will go really horribly terrible and uh will horribly test cedar um and uh, throw her more into this family i guess we'll see i guess we shall see all right more videos later